Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Atlanta for the seventh and deciding game of the National League Championship Series between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Atlanta Braves. And welcome. I'm Sean McDonough along with Tim McCarver, and it's great to have you with us as the pitch three times. But if he does, it will be bucking a trend for Atlanta pitchers, the starting pitchers. Steve Avery went only a third of an In inning. 246 outside. innings. And he walks Cole to start the ball game. Alex did not swing at a, a three games to one lead. That's a fair ball. Has the dive of Sid Bream and down into the corner. Fielded by Justice. Cole will be held at third. Van Slyke in a second with a double. Last night he was thinking about it, and he said, I think I'll move Merced to the fifth hole. And it well hit. Right field. Deep enough to get the run in as Justice makes the catch in front of the track. Cole across with the first run of the ball game, and the Pirates lead one to nothing in the first inning. And he's running, and King pops it up. Berry Hill and Pendleton. It's Berry Hill to end the inning. The Pirates are on the board with one run in the top of the. And if you're keeping score at home. King, the diving stop. To his feet to throw him out. In the air and right field, not deep. Hold the catch. The Braves go in order in the first. After one in game seven. Versus Smoltz. That's why they're in there. Those are the three highest batting averages. Four, seven and eight. Dravek with a high fly ball along the right field line for Justice. The Pirates go in order in the second. A couple of his fellow umpires came in from the field to check on McSherry. And now they're all, those in the infield at least, conferring with John McSherry at home plate. He does not seem to be feeling well. I think the other umpires may be asking John if he needs relief behind the plate. Obviously the home plate umpire, the most important umpire of the six. John. Thank you, Jim. You can imagine that for the umpires this is as exciting an experience as it is for the participants and this has to be personally Greatly disappointing to John McSherry as he heads off. Ed Montague, the home plate umpire last night, talking about. Tried to check his swing, but could not. And the We're there again. The well, one-two pitch. Line to center on the run. Van Slyke, he dives and makes a great catch. That's why you want all those gold gloves. Even told us that never crossed his mind. Barry Hill drives with a deep center field. Van Slyke on the run to the wall. It's off the wall. He has a long way to go to track it down, but Barry Hill is slow, and he stops at second. To get Barry Hill in, he does not run well. That's down to third. Barry Hill cannot advance as King throws Lemke out. Sharply hit, but Merced has it. And the Braves cannot capitalize on the leadoff double by Barry Hill. leading game seven of the NLCS to the top of the fifth now Mike Lavalier the catcher for Pittsburgh up against small the walk punched out instead well hit and hooking toward the corner Gant was over in left center field he has a long way to go to retrieve it and Chico Lean has a one out double and the runner at second base is Jose Lean struck him out of the breaking ball Drabeck lost the bat Doug as you can see that's well hit to right Justice in front of the track makes the catch. Halfway through game seven of the National League Championship Series, John Smoltz and the Braves trail one to nothing. You tried to forget about those ground yeah, balls, huh? We had to remind you. And look at the drop on that curveball he yeah. just finished Gant with, and that brings up Berry Hill, who had doubled his last time. Lean from the outfield grass. And another one, two, three inning for Drayback. And a short one, which was really yep. important that yep. uh, done it twice in their history. Bell rips one into the left field corner. Gant will play it off the wall as Jay Bell pulls in a second with a double. So these two teams have combined for four hits. Up the middle, Lemke can't get it. 
Bell being waved around, and he will score, and the Pirates lead 2 to nothing. Andy Van Slyke. Van Slyke on the run. King lifts it. And in left center, Gant has room. The Pirates score again with one run in the sixth. It's starting to set in. There's a base hit. And that brings the fans to their feet. Just the second base runner of the night for Atlanta. Slap to left, a little pop-up. Long run for Bonds, he can't get it. Lemke to second. He squares to Bunt. A high chopping bunt, could be a problem. Merced has no play. The 2-1 pitch, fastball line to third, caught, double play. Right at King was the line drive, and he easily doubled off Lemke. He was just low. The runner's off with the 3-2 pitch. Line to left. Bond started in. He's there and makes the catch. The Braves loaded the bases with nobody out and failed to score the double play. A huge play. And we go to the Delivered to left. Stanton has been perfect in his four appearances prior to tonight in terms of not allowing Fielding a run and Mike Stanton the left-hander in there greeted immediately by the base hit by Mike Lavalier Jim Leland the left he's just 24 years old Drabeck gets the bunt down Breen has to go to first the lengthy covering it's a sacrifice the play goes 3-4 and Pittsburgh has a runner SP our Gary Varsho both left-handed hitters SP a, a switch hitter of course but with Jay Bell, you may bring the right-hander in. And Bell Smith, 7-0 this year. He was 7-4 at Richmond. And he's worked three and two-thirds innings, giving up two hits. That was in. Now the 3-0 pitch. Ball four. He walked him on four pitches. That was a breaking ball. A breaking ball on a 3-0. The base is loaded. Steve Avery, the third pitcher of the inning, the fourth pitcher of the night for the Braves making only his second major league relief appearance. He was the starting pitcher for the break. With another one-two pitch. Fly ball, it'll stay in the ballpark. And Otis Nixon is there. The Pirates leave the bases loaded without scoring in the seventh. Seventh inning stretch in game seven. Sid Bream lines it at slicing away from Van Slyke and in for an extra base hit. Bream after five knee operations, doesn't run very well, and it doesn't really matter in this game. Another payoff pitch. Ball four. What a great at bat. The one-two pitch. High fly ball, shallow center. A routine play for Van Slyke. And the Braves strand two more. They've left five. We go to the eight. Doug Drabeck and the Pirates with a 2-0. Barry Bonds leads off against Steve Avery with a base hit. He took a 1-0 pitch into right field for his first hit of the night. He's one for three. Slap down the right field line. It is a fair ball right along the line. The runner is being waved around third. Merced to the plate, and he is out at home. Ball. It was a fair ball. Now the one-two pitch. Softly toward left. Gant makes the running catch. Two-two pitch. Struck him out. Blew him away with the fastball. Struck him out. Another live fastball from Drabeck who works a one-two-three eighth inning while striking out two. He spanned five and we go to the ninth. The Pirates two and the Braves nothing. Realizing now that Atlanta has three outs to prevent their team from going to the World Series. Lean trying to pad the lead at the wall. Gant the catch. The Jeff reared and greeted with a long fly to left by Lean this season. Raybeck chased the pitch way out of the strike zone. And 
That's ball four. Reardon walks him on four pitches. He got Wally Fingers for the save in the game against the Yankees. That's back to the backstop, and now the runner is in scoring position. Bell down to third. Pendleton stayed down with it, and that ends the inning. Last call for the Atlanta Braves. Pendleton, Justice, and Breen coming up. We go to the bottom of the ninth in game seven of the National League Championship Series. Pittsburgh leads two to nothing. He walked one, and that was after a battle with Gantle, a 3-2 pitch in the seventh. Pendleton pulls it down the right field line, hooking toward the corner. It is a fair ball. Pendleton on his way to second with a laid off double. Rounded to the right, booted by Reed. Pendleton to third on the play. The 3-0 to Brady. Ball four. Eight innings plus, 129 pitches. After the second walk that he issued tonight, Stan Belinda takes over. Tying run at second, winning run at first. Gant hits one to left. Bonds on the track. At the wall makes the catch. Pendleton on to score the first Atlanta run of the ball game. Three-one pitch. Ball four. Oh, so close was the last pitch to Barry Hill. And the bases loaded in the bottom of the nine. Hunter, little looper, leaned is there and makes the catch. The runner tags but will not try it. Down in the bottom of the ninth. He hacked at the 2-0, now the 2-1. Line drive and a base hit! Just as the score of the tying run, Green to the play! And he is safe! Safe at the plate! The Braves go to the World Series!